The first time I really tried sake, I was in a tiny isekai in Osaka. I had some cheap stuff before, but never thought about how it was made or what premium sake would be like. That first taste was a revelation. I thought, all of this from brewing rice? A swirl of sweet and savory, fruity and earthy filled my senses. It was like nothing I'd tried before. It was cold, smooth as glass on my tongue, and it was so easy to drink. I tried so many different styles of sake that evening. I was astounded at how many different breweries created entirely new flavors. The whole place was erupting in kanpai as this American guy was falling in love with sake. I began learning more about my newfound passion. The Japanese people have been brewing sake for well over a thousand years. There are four main ingredients in traditional sake. Rice, water, yeast, and koji mold, which helps start the fermentation process. Everything about its production is a craft, from harvesting and milling the rice, to growing koji and fermenting the brew. It's actually brewed more like beer than wine, though the alcohol content is similar to wine. The whole process is precise and elegant. It totally captivated me. After returning home, I wanted to keep exploring sake. I learned that there's a growing number of North American sake breweries. After spending a few years home brewing and building up my skills, I'm proud to be counted among them. Sake brewing is beautiful. It's another world here in your backyard. The final product comes down to skill and intuition mixed with artistry. A lot of late nights and a bit of magic. This is real craft alcohol. This is next level brewing fueled by passion and a dedication to the craft. And this is North American Sake's moment. Word is spreading. People are looking for something new, something bold, something exceptional, and something that goes with just about everything. I always tell people that sake is not just for sushi restaurants. It pairs perfectly with steak, pizza, burgers, seafood, and the options are limitless. Serve a chilled bottle with your next meal and taste the magic. You don't need fancy glasses or a specific atmosphere. It's for everyone. Begin your sake journey. Mine began in an izakaya joint in Osaka. Yours could begin tonight on your own back porch with a locally made craft sake. Kanpai.